completely different type of debate, not just the town hall style, which allowed Governor Romney and President Obama to talk directly to voters, but in the tone of both men. Uh, President Obama had the bigger burden this time because he was so listless in his first debate, uh, so disengaged, that he came across as the weaker candidate. You had an incumbent president who really came in fiery this time. He took every question regardless of the topic, as an opportunity to challenge Governor Romney. Governor Romney's challenge was, was different this time. He almost had the feel of a front-runner, even though they're, they're essentially tied. Governor Romney was the one who came in with the, with the bigger poise, with the bigger command out of the last debate, and more momentum. So he stayed aggressive as well, certainly got in the president's face a few times. But his challenge was more to sort of say, I'm a plausible alternative to you. I'm, I'm the guy who can stand here, take a punch, and keep going. They both had different missions. It was a really interesting debate in so many ways because of the flavor of it, because of the intensity, the tension between the two of them in that room. Now, these debates are often defined by memorable moments, and there was one at the end as it related to Libya. The question was about the security at the consulate in Libya where four Americans were killed and who was responsible. And everyone was sort of waiting to see how President Obama would respond to that because this has become a flashpoint in the campaign. Secretary Clinton has done an extraordinary job, but she works for me. I'm the president. Where that moment really got interesting was when Governor Romney, as was his case throughout the debate, challenged the president and said, you, didn't, you weren't straight with the American people. You didn't call it an act of terrorism. It was a terrorist attack, um, and it took a long time for that to be told to the American people. President Obama said, yes, I did. Check the transcript. And they got into a really heated back and forth there. What you saw from Obama at that moment was a reminder to the American people, in his view anyway, that he was in charge. He said, Governor Romney, I'm the president. I take offense at the idea that I would play politics with this. And voters got to decide right there who do they believe more, but, but really they also got to see two men who fiercely want this job, who fiercely are trying to beat the other one. And that's what made this debate so much more intense.